They're among the hottest fashion accessories in Hollywood and around the world, and they're designed and made right here on the Central Coast. Stella Page Design handbags have been draped over the arms of many Hollywood stars. After a few years of studying and working in LA's fashion industry, their creator has returned to her roots here on the Central Coast and moved into this building in Moss Landing. I could live anywhere, and I've chosen Moss Landing. As you can see, I have this beautiful view of the Elkhorn Slough, uh, the sand dunes, and then the Monterey Bay. 2006, I went to Tokyo, Kyoto, Hong Kong, and then on to Ho Chi Minh City. And um, even though I love seeing the world, I love coming back to Moss Landing. It's, to me, the most beautiful place in the world. Here, she and her team create, by hand, some of the most unique and beautiful handbags in the world. I had to start from scratch when I moved here, and now I have just this incredible crew of women that are incredibly talented. Each one of them individually is a talented artist. When someone calls you on the phone, for instance, and says the simple question, you know, what sets you apart, you know, what do you tell them? We make limited edition handbags, and currently we're doing a run of approximately 100 per design. It's all hand-applied artwork. We use excellent skins and leathers, so our craftsmanship is something we pride ourselves on. The finished product is out here on the table. All of our different designs, our different motifs, the different styles that our handbags come in. My sense of design comes strictly from my, from my spirit. And I think there's something very eclectic about it. It's my perception and my taste of how I view the world. And I think that shines through on the product. This is our Sophie. And this bag, this shape was the one that we gifted to the Emmy Awards in 2006. We did 85 of these handbags, went out to celebrities. We do do some lighter colors going into spring and summer. So we have this beautiful little butterscotch, lucite, marbled lucite box clutch. Supportive clients include my friend and former co-worker, Dina Eastwood, someone uniquely aware of both Moss Landing and Oscar night fashions. When I got my first Stella Page purse and I did a little bit of research and somehow Stella and I ended up corresponding. When I saw the return address in Moss Landing, I thought it was a typo. I thought, oh, there's a Moss Landing, Pennsylvania, or a Moss Landing, New York. It gave me a real sense of pride because I have seen these things on the red carpet or in some of the very upscale department stores or boutiques. And to know that this person exists right here at home makes it even better. It is like having a badge of couture honor People who know about that kind of stuff say, oh, you have a Stella Page. I always wear all black. Carmel Magazine columnist Suzanne Hamilton says her bag gets plenty of attention. One story that cracks me up every time I think about it is I'm, I'm rushing off to a meeting. I have cell phone in hand. I've got the Stella Page bag in my right. And this lady rolls down her car window and actually says, where did you get that gorgeous handbag? So I have to go across the street and write down all the information. I didn't have her card on me. But um, everywhere I go, it's, I call it the Stella Page craze. So the next time you're in Moss Landing, step inside Stella Page Design for a little piece of Hollywood. That people are receptive to my art is just a wonderful thing for me. I think I'll keep on doing what I do. Keep on making beautiful handbags.